Thank you so much. I'm your brother's regret. We need to deeply reflect. Tunubu as president, if he is sworn in and he sits as president, let us go into deeper reflection and ponder over this. What type of election? How credible will election under Tinubu? How credible will INEC conduct an election under Tinubu as president? Remember, you cannot give what you do not have. Will in 2014, people cried out. It is impossible for you to get anything credible, free and fair, under Bugari. People will refuse to listen. You can't give what you do not have. You see, the holy books pointed it out that the one that's accustomed to doing evil cannot do good. What quality? What is the quality of the election that will be conducted? Under Tinubu as president. This is what Nigerian people should be reflecting on. What will be the implication to the future of Nigeria? Already, the youths are so discouraged. And the youths represent the future of Nigeria. Many of them have vowed never to vote again in their lifetime. Many of them have destroyed their international passport. Say they have nothing to do with Nigeria again. What will be the quality of election that will be conducted under Tinubu as president? This is food for thought. Every Nigeria should pay attention to this. So those who can pray should start praying now. Those who can cry out to God with tears, with groaning, with traveling, let them begin now. When once it is established, that there can never be free and fair election in a nation. There is no future for that country. If it's established that Nigeria can never have free and fair election, there will never be election that will be credible under a sitting president, then the future is gone. Unemployment will hit the rooftop because investors cannot come here. Insecurity will hit the rooftop Anarchy will reign supreme because people will no longer have confidence even in the judiciary. What will be the quality of election under Ahmed Bola Tinubu as a sitting president? That is food for thought. Let us pray now. Danger looms large. May God save Nigeria. Thank you and God bless you.